Hey guys, this is Alex from FitLab, and welcome to our comparison of the Garmin Forerunner 55 versus Garmin Forerunner 245. You'll find the links to the products in the description, and you can use the links to check the latest prices and other user reviews. Make sure to watch until the end to know our final verdict on which is better. So, the main difference between these two is the physical size. The Garmin Forerunner 245 is larger than the 55. The Forerunner 245 has dimensions of 42.3 by 42.3 by 12.2 millimeters, while the 55 measures 42 by 42 by 11.6 millimeters. It also has a larger screen size of 1.2 inches compared to the 55 at 1.04 inches. A larger screen size makes it easier to view items on your watch. However, this makes the Forerunner 245 heavier at 38.5 grams compared to 37 grams for the Forerunner 55. Music The Forerunner 245 comes with the ability to play music on the watch. The key selling feature for the Forerunner 245 is its ability to play up to 500 songs on its 3.5GB storage. This is lacking in the Forerunner 55. You can also stream music from Deezer, Spotify, Apple Music, and iHeartRadio. This ability to play music is also the reason the 245 is pricier than the 55. Display The Forerunner 245 has a better quality display than the 55. The Forerunner 245 is equipped with the Corning Gorilla Glass 3, while the 55 has the chemically strengthened glass. The 245 screen has a resolution of 240 by 240 pixels compared to 208 by 208 pixels for the Forerunner 55. Battery life the Forerunner 55 offers one better battery life performance than the 245. The Forerunner 55 gives you up to two weeks on the smartwatch battery, which is longer than up to seven days for the 245. However, the Forerunner 245 offers you up to 24 hours on GPS mode, compared to 20 hours for the Forerunner 55. You'll also achieve up to six hours on GPS and music for the Forerunner 245. Advanced Running Metrics the Forerunner 245 comes with additional advanced running metrics. Unlike the Forerunner 55, you do get cool running metrics like ground contact time, vertical oscillation, ground contact balance, cadence, vertical ratio, and stride length. You will need to invest in the Garmin HRM run chest strap and running dynamics pod to access these features. Features Both sport a diversity of features that may be present on one while lacking in another. The Forerunner 55 comes with HIT, and 24-7 respiratory rate that's lacking in the Forerunner 245. The latter has more total running features of 16 versus 11 for the 55. You also get one extra sport mode in the 245 at 15 modes compared to 14 modes in the Forerunner 55. The Forerunner 245 comes with additional features like indoor rowing and pulse ox blood oxygen. Specifications comparison. From the table, you'll note that the Forerunner 245 is larger and slightly heavier than the 55. It also allows you to play your music as you work out. With 3.5 gigabytes of storage, you can play up to 500 songs. Similarities. The watches do come with similar features like GPS, optical heart rate monitor, GLONASS plus Galileo glass, accelerometer, 24 seven activity tracking, cycling indoors and running outdoors tracking, body energy monitor, advanced sleep tracking, all day stress, safety tracking, and connectivity to Bluetooth, Wi-Fi, and ANT+. You also have waterproofing up to a depth of 5 ATM. The watches also have 11 similar running features, but the Forerunner 245 comes with six extra, trail running, performance condition, stride length, ground contact time, running dynamics, and vertical oscillation and ratio. You also get the same 14 sports modes, but the Forerunner 245 has an extra trail running mode. So which is better? The Garmin Forerunner 245 comes with the ability for music storage, which is lacking in the Forerunner 55. This is an advantage for those who like listening to music as they work out. If you like this video, please hit the thumbs up button and subscribe to our channel. Also, let us know in the comments section which one you prefer between the two and why. Which other comparisons would you like to see next from us? Let us know that as well.